Hey guys, this is Brandy with another tutorial. And in this tutorial, I'm going to teach you all how to use my Facebook Resize and Sharpen Action. So let's not waste any more time and let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go here and select Actions. If you don't have this button, you can also go to Window and click on Actions from there. Now you want to locate your Facebook Resize and Sharpen Action. Mine is here, so I'm going to click on the arrow. And you have three different options here. So you have the option to resize your image as 2,048 pixels, 920 pixels, or 720 pixels. So a rule of thumb is if your image's size is, small, is smaller than 2,048 pixel, pixels, you're going to go down to the 920. If it's smaller than 920 already, go down to 720. Um, to see your image's size, you're going to click on image, image size. So right here it says that my width, which is what uh, the action is changing, is 2,048 pixels. So I'm going to resize mine to 920 instead. So select the play button. And select stop. And that has resized and sharpened your image. Now it's very over sharpened, and I did that to give you guys, you know, wiggle room. So if it's too much sharpness for you, you can either lower the opacity, and you can also click on your layer mask, select B for your brush tool, and make sure that you have a soft black brush selected. And I'm not liking the sharpness in his hair. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to erase it. And make sure your opacity is at 100%. I'm also just going to remove it from his skin. And that's all there is to it. So uh, if you've already purchased this action, thank you so, so much. And if you haven't, you can do so at www.brandyreneephotography.com. Oh, don't forget to flatten your image. And then you're done. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Bye.